Welcome back to JDME. As part of CKA exam series, we'll discuss a new and short chat question. So this question says we need to install and configure container network interface of uh, any one of our choice. So here we have two container network interfaces. So one is Planel and one is Calico. So for this question, we'll discuss uh, how to install Planel in our Kubernetes cluster in uh, exam environment. Uh, how we need to do this so already in the question itself uh, we can see right the manifest file already we have so we need to go ahead and directly deploy it but it's not that straight away and easy first we need to verify a few things and then we can start applying this manifest go into the actual question so before that kubectl get ports open so f and e i'll just verify in cube system is the ports are running all fine or not everything is working so keeps it will get nodes uh yes all the nodes are ready so we are clear to go ahead and do this uh, apply cube ctl apply so this is the manifest which we have uh, referring from the question so cube panel right so that's what i'm trying to apply it so the moment when i apply Okay, I got it. So now I need to verify the ports in the Qflannel namespace. Okay, so, oh, the, the ports are not running. So we'll verify what is the issue with the ports. Okay, kubectl logs and the part name followed by the namespace. That is kubeflannel. Okay, the error. The existing network failed to acquire the lease. Okay, 10.24 244.0016 specified in the Planel Net configuration. So that means this is the address it is specified in the config map of the Planel. And, uh, but it is trying to run the parts on this CADR range. So what we will do, we will add this CADR range okay node 0 1 is this range and the node uh, control plane is in a might be the other range so what i will do is i'll just modify the flannel um, config map configuration uh, of this network so kubectl okay first i need to get the config map of uh, the flannel in the kubeflannel namespace okay so now i can edit it i did the config map cube flannel config and the namespace also need to provide okay yeah this is what uh, it says in the error, error clearly mentioned that it is using the different uh, segment range that is not matching so we need to update it on dot one sixty eight dot zero zero slash sixteen we will go with the sixteen range as uh, we uh, the control plane and uh, both are like worker nodes are running under the this range okay i will save it the moment i will save still you can see the ports will be in crash loop or error state only so we you need to delete uh, the ports delete pod and the pod name if you pass here okay fnn cube system sorry not cube system Planner. Ah, something is missed. Delete pod FNN. Oh my bad. Okay. Planner. Okay. The pod is deleted now, and we will delete the other pod also, and then we will verify all the together. So the other pod name is this gun. So I have deleted this. Now I will verify the pods. Yes, the pods are running now. So I think we are successfully set up the queue flannel. CMI in our cluster. Now it's time to test. Uh, I'm not sure if you want to test it, you can test it. But um, we need to just make sure that it's uh, okay. Ensure the selected uh, CNI is properly installed and configured in the Kubernetes cluster. So it is properly configured, but if you want to make sure whether it is working or not, so I have a simple commands to execute that. So let's go to go ahead and test it. So we will create a two test pods and we will test uh, each other whether they are running or not okay uh, whether they are 
listening to each other or not so i have created two parts okay now i have a command to just execute and uh, test whether it is uh, from one part to other part whether it is working or not that's it uh, let me test that Ping bad address okay test 2 i have given that's why it is not working so what i'll do is i will just get the parts if it will get parts okay test one and test two okay i think I, I need to get the ip address wide okay so i'm just doing the test right so if i copy this if i go instead of test uh, if i give the ip yes see it is pinging thanks for watching that's it for this question